shocking statistic and a love of dogs has turned dog trainer Ben Person's hobby into a full-time job. Years ago, I read stats on how many dogs were put down every year, and I just couldn't believe it till I checked with a few different sources. And sure enough, there's millions of dogs being put down in North America every year for common problems like housebreaking, aggression, chewing, barking. So um, I realized that, uh, yes, I'm in this as a business, but I wanted to do something a little bit um, bigger, uh, a goodwill project. For over 20 years, Ben's been training and teaching tricks to dogs. He's also training kids about being responsible dog owners. Hope that at the end of my day, when I hang up my Frisbee, I can say I've been a good ambassador for, for dogs and uh, responsible dog ownership. I think it's so important for the kids, the future generation, to hear about that. We're a social responsibility school, which means that's one of the foundational things we talk to kids about, is how we treat one another. And how we treat animals, I think, is the same, uh, has the same importance, so it makes sense. It's also important to have parents be responsible, too. Between ballet and swimming lessons and, and cello, you know, just getting to spend time with the dog. So, yeah, the kids need to understand that it is a big commitment. And the parents also need to understand that, that the kids at a young age are often so busy that the parents need time for that. Otherwise, the dog may end up being another statistic. Five and a half month old Joey is a border collie. And already he's earning his chops or toys before a crowd. And it seems the kids love Joey as much as he likes performing. We start when we get them at seven weeks and uh, it's amazing what they can learn in a very short time frame so long as you're making it fun and that means there's no shouting, there's no pulling on the leash, in fact they don't even have a leash on. It's all um, motivation, be it toys, food. To get the kind of results that you just saw, to get really fast results where the dog's tail is just going full time, you need to motivate them. Motivation comes in many forms. A lot of people think that food is the end all and be all, and food has its place just for the first two weeks. We replace the food with toys um, anywhere between two and three weeks. Animals, pets of any kind, you know, do teach kids. It calms kids down when animals are around, and uh, I think it's a positive thing. But I think, you know, as we train our animals, we also train our kids to understand the, the role of pets in our society. So it's an important thing. There you go. Take it. <laughs> Proper training and pet education is not only good for kids, but it's good for your furry friends too. For the Express in Vancouver, I'm Amy Catriona.